We have an earthquake of magnitude 3.2 in the Richter scale at a depth of 5 km. It is near the graben formed uh, glacial lake uh, Clairefort Watten, and uh, this is part of the Christovic volcanic system, which transfers at this stage at a depth the movement due to the activation of the uh, Grindavik Hagafall Swartzengi uh, volcanic system toward the east. If it doesn't happen, you will have uh, no opening of the ground and the land will not open. The movement in that area which leads to eruption, and you can see here we have a dike at the depth, you can see that that's uh, just uh, short of Grindavik. That is the, where the magma is rising. We have a Swartzengi uh, volcanic system uh, bulging up in the form of a lacolith, creating a seal further down, and due to the earthquake and opening up of the ground, we have a dike formed, a crash zone that the magma can rise. When the movement in one part happens, it has to transfer the movement to the other side. Otherwise, we will not have eruption. This is the reason we have this volcanic system here. Iceland is on the mid-Atlantic ridge. And when the transfer of movement happens, and the magma associated with that moves, squeezed out like a toothpaste, we will have eruption. This is what we have. Uh, magma source creating a seal and a dike in a graben form where we had the Hagerfoss and Dunka craters near the Swartzengi. Swartzengi is that magma source under it is rising, bulging up. Then through the dike, we have the magma rising, creating an eruption. This is what we saw in the Hagerfoss just a few uh, days ago. And this may happen again in the area of the Hagerfoss. Nothing to do with the uh, Chrysovic at this stage. Chrysovic at this stage is not active. The airways are limited to the depth of 5 kilometers. 